The first time he's been seen in public since he was hospitalized back in May after he says he collapsed at an event in Tennessee. But today I sat down with him one on one to hear all about it. I decided that everybody in this day and age has to live to be 100. At 86 years young, Atlanta's former mayor is living up to his name. According to him, Ambassador Andrew Young has at least 14 more years to go. I've spent this last couple of months trying to decide what is my role for the next 15 years. But back in May, life made him slow down, right as he was about to speak at Fisk University. I just collapsed in Nashville, and they I diagnosed this uh, staph infection which had gone pretty far. He went from Vanderbilt Hospital to Emory. I really was sick for two months. He says it gave him time to reflect. I think one of the things that happens to you when you're 86 and really sick is you're much more aware of death uh, than ordinarily, normally. And I never felt that I wasn't gonna recover, but I realized how close I came. 50 years ago, he was following Dr. King around the world, and for the 50th anniversary of his assassination, most of those places wanted him to come back. He says jet setting was easy 50 years ago. But 50 years ago, I was 35. <laughs> it evidently really wore me down this time. Now he's back on his feet, even if it's just long enough to find another seat. But he still gets the attention of the whole room. Sunday morning, that room was the sanctuary of his home church, First Congregational Church. We related to people as children of God. Ambassador Young started preaching more than 60 years ago when he was 21. And back then, they had a saying. Down here, we don't believe in no paper in the pulpit. You're going to have to speak from your heart. And oh, he did. I really have come out of this period of sickness feeling very good about the future. His foundation works to help feed the hungry, and he tells me he's excited to put his effort there. And while his body isn't the same as it was when he was 35. My heart and my mind are good enough, and I, I, I think I'll be able to help for a little while longer. In Atlanta, Christy Etheridge, 11 Alive News.